Sheffield Libraries and I think it's rhyme time number 22. 22, that's two twos when you write it down, those of you who are learning to write. So last week's rhyme time was about some animals, but they're different from this week. So last week we had pets and farm animals, so animals that people often look after. Um, and this week it's about wild animals, like jungle animals, animals that people don't often look after and that live all by themselves in the wild. So, are you excited to see what's coming up? I am! Right, shall we get started straight away with our hello song? Remember, we always start with the hello song so we know we have begun. The first verse is always waving because that's how we say hello. And then we change the other verses and we put in whatever we like. <clears throat> now, sometimes it's different movements like clapping and stamping. Today, because the theme is about wild animals, I'm going to put in some animal noises. I'm thinking, I was trying to think of some like loud animals that make interesting noises. So how about an owl? I like an owl noise. They go twit to woo. Twit woo, they hoot. Twit woo. And what's a really loud wild animal? It's a big cat with a big mane and it roars. It's a lion. We'll do our third verse about a lion roaring. So I hope you're ready to roar. Okay, here we go. Wave your hands. Hello, wave your hands. Hello, wave your hands. Hello, wave your hands. Hello. Ready to be an owl. Hoot like an owl. Twit woo. Hoot like an owl. Twit woo. Ho hoot like an owl. Twit woo. Hoot like an owl. Twit woo. I like doing that with my hands because it makes the sound more echoey. Oh. Lion, ready? Roar like a lion, roar! 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 Oh, did you really put everything into pretending to be a lion? Roaring all round your living room. <laughs> I'm going to sing a song about a very big wild animal. That is why I have stood up so that I can take up all the space. All the space because we are going to sing about an elephant. And you need to do elephant actions and you need to be very big. You need to be able to wave your trunk up high and you need to stomp, stomp stomp through the jungle because they're quite big and heavy, aren't they? Whew. Shall we try it? Here we go. I'm a big grey lump and I thump, thump, thump through the jungle hot and green with my long white tusks and my great big trunk I'm the biggest thing you've seen. Thump, 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 trumpety trump, an elephant am I. I'm the biggest living animal under the jungle sky. I thump, 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 trumpety trump, an elephant am I. I thump, 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 trumpety trump, an elephant am I. See me suck the cool water up my trunk, see me squirt it over me. With my big long trunk I can reach quite high, eat bananas off a tree. Thump, 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 trumpety trump, 
an elephant am I. I'm the biggest living animal under the jungle sky. I thump, 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 tramp, to tramp, an elephant am I. I thump, 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 tramp, to tramp, an elephant am I. Are you? Did you act out being an elephant? Thump, 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 tramp, to tramp. I'm a big trunk. Now, where is somewhere you could go to see some wild jungle animals if you couldn't see them in the wild? Some people go and see them in a zoo, don't they? Hopefully it's a good zoo where they keep the animals safe and happy and they've got lots of space to move around. This song is all about Daddy taking us to the zoo. <laughs> it's really, really fun. So. We sing about Daddy taking us to the zoo and then we sing about some of the animals that we're going to see there. Okay, are you ready? Daddy's taking us to the zoo tomorrow, zoo tomorrow, zoo tomorrow. Daddy's taking us to the zoo tomorrow, we can stay all day. We're going to the zoo, zoo, zoo. How about you, 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 you can come too, too, too. We're going to the zoo, zoo. Zoo, who could we see there? How about the elephant? We all like the elephant, don't we? Are you ready? See the elephant, long trunk swinging, great big ears, the long trunk swinging, sniffing up peanuts with the long trunk swinging. We can stay all day, we go into the zoo, zoo, zoo. How about you, 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 you can come too, too. Zoo. We're going to the zoo, zoo, zoo. Ooh, it's bouncy. Can you dance to this tune? What other animal might we see? How about the monkeys? And the monkeys, they do kind of squish, squish, scratching. Yeah? Are you ready? Here we go. See all the monkeys squish, squish, scratching, jumping all around and squish, squish, scratching, hanging by their long tails. They hang, don't they? Hanging by their long tails, squish, squish, scratching. We can stay all day, we're going to the zoo, zoo, zoo. How about you, 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 you can come too, too, too. We're going to the zoo, zoo, zoo. Yay! Go and see all the animals. And maybe you can make up some other verses about other animals you've seen. Next, we are going to sing a song that we all like very much. It's about monkeys jumping on the bed. But I haven't got five monkey toys, and maybe you haven't got five monkey toys either. So you can use any toys, or you can just use your fingers and bounce them around, and then go down to four fingers and three fingers. Do you know the song? The monkeys bounce on the bed, and then one falls off and bumps his head, and then mum phones the doctor, and I've got my phone for the actions. All right. Although there's not going to be much jumping on here or they'll all fall off at once. So <laughs> shall we see how it goes? Here we go. Five little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Mum phoned the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. <gasps> Do you think the monkeys are going to listen? Hmm, I don't. Here we go, are you ready? Four little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off, whoa, and bumped his head. Mum phoned the doctor, and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. I don't know, I don't know if they'll listen. How many have we got left now? One, two, three. Are you ready, monkeys? Three little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off. Ah, and bumped his head. Oh no. Mum phoned the doctor. And the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. I think that doctor's getting a bit cross now. I wonder if mum's getting a bit cross now. Hmm. What would your grown-ups do if you jumped on the bed? 
Be very careful, no bumping of heads. How many have we got left? One, two. Are you ready? Two little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off. Ooh, I bumped her head. Oh, Mum's home, the doctor. And the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. Oh, how many times do I have to tell you? No more monkeys jumping on the bed. How many are left? Just the one. Look at this. Remember, it's not a real monkey. <laughs> I think this one is an otter. Hello. He's <laughs> cute, isn't he? Right. One little monkey jumping on the bed. She fell off. Uh-oh. And bumped her head. <gasps> Mum phoned the doctor. What do you think he said? No more monkeys jumping on the bed. He's really cross now. Well, that's fine because we have no more monkeys jumping on the bed because they all had to go to bed until they felt better. So you guys be careful, all right? Do you know the story of Noah's Ark? It's a story where there came a great big flood and Noah had to build an ark, which is a big, big, big wooden boat to save his family and all the animals. And there is a song about this ark and it's a song about the animals going in two by two. Uh, and each verse has some different animals in it. Are you ready? The animals went in two by two, hurrah, hurrah. The animals went in two by two, hurrah, hurrah. The animals went in two by two, the elephant and the kangaroo. And they all went into the ark for to get out of the rain. The animals went in three by three, hurrah, hurrah. The animals went in three by three, hurrah, hurrah. The animals went in three by three, the wasp, the ant and the bumblebee. And they all went into the ark for to get out of the rain. The animals went in four by four, hurrah, hurrah. The animals went in four by four, hurrah, hurrah. The animals went in four by four, the great hippopotamus stuck in the door. And they all went into the ark for to get out of the rain. Ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum. You can make loads of verses to this and just keep putting other animals in and see if you can make them rhyme. That would be quite a challenge, wouldn't it? Who have we got here? These are two little owls and they are called Billy and Fluff. <laughs> They're very cute, aren't they? And uh, we did sing a song with some owl noises in right at the beginning of today's session and it went twit woo, twit woo. And that's what noise owls make, isn't it? So, Billy and Fluff are going to sing the goodbye song with me because we are finished now. We have finished our rhyme time for today. So I hope you've enjoyed all the interesting wild and jungle animals and I hope you've made some animal noises at home and joined in with us and now we're ready to say goodbye and hope you will come back next week for a mystery theme that I haven't decided yet. <laughs> Here we go. Goodbye, don't cry. Wipe the tear, baby tear, from your eye. Though it's hard to part, I know. It's time, so off we go. Goodbye, don't sigh. There's a silver lining in the sky. Bonsoir, old thing, cheerio, ting, ting, na, poo, toodaloo, goodbye. Gonna wave goodbye. Is Billy gonna wave goodbye? Is Fluff going to wave goodbye? <laughs> Is Laura going to wave goodbye? And we will see you next time. Have a great week. Bye.